Hey guys, welcome to Rough Riders. I'm Jay Taylor. Today we're taking a look at bean trailers. This is a mean bean teardrop. So let's go check it out. Okay, we are here with Chip and his bean trailer. Uh, this is the mean bean model and uh, he's going to kind of walk us through this and help us uh, understand what this trailer is all about. So uh, first off, you got this three weeks ago, is that correct? Yes, sir. Yep. Awesome. Three weeks. And this is your first trip out? Yeah, first trip out. Thought we'd make it here in Yellowstone. Beautiful. All right, so what can you tell us about your trailer? Uh, well, there's a lot There's a lot of things. Uh, for one, um, we got these big doors that we really like getting in and out. Um, then like this. So it's good to get in. We got uh, the screen doors. So you got nice screen doors with it. Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, both sides. Okay, and then uh, you got the you know, kind of these little privacy windows that kind of open and close to the vent, and then inside you got this beautiful cabinetry work, and those are pass through, right? Correct. Yep. They go through to the galley on the uh, outside kitchen. Okay. Nice windows on each side for oh, on the one side for ventilation, plus the screen doors, and you got a nice cubby up there. And then this uh, couch folds into a queen size bed? Yeah, this is a full size queen bed. Uh, it's got a four inch foam mattress. Uh, it's, it's extremely comfortable too. It's probably more comfortable than the house uh, bed we got at the home. So when we got our first got our trailer, we, we actually slept in it the first couple of nights out in the driveway. Did you guys do the same thing? We, we did it in the garage, yeah. <laughs> yeah we were right I think like that's this. common with all of us teardrop uh, guys. I'd, I'd agree. Um, the other thing is we got this, um, let me crawl in here real quick. This is got, uh, an attic, it's officially... So oh, attic storage there. there. Yep, sorry, it's got some storage up here. But okay. Also we'll, um, oops, let me go that back on. Okay, oh, so the LED dim, sort of uh, dimmable lighting. And up here, we'll, we'll get that on there, we'll turn that up. Okay, oh, lighting, lighting in the, oh, that's nice. And so you can actually see here. it in the cubby as well. Okay. And then you got a, uh, is that like a fantastic fan or what is, what is that? Yes, yeah, so actually this is a, um, Speed control fan. It's a speed control fan that you can come standard. Uh, we upgraded. We've got the remote control. <laughs> okay. <laughs> they, you know, um, so it has different speeds. It'll set the temperature. It has intake, outtake, as far as air conditioner, air conditioner, as far as uh, venting. Um, so that's that's a really nice feature to have. Very cool. It also has uh, a couple oh. of on each side. The essentials. Okay. Yeah. Like yeah. This. Very good. And then you got, I see you got storage underneath the carpet. <laughs> we have storage underneath. Okay. Just real quick. Sorry. No worries. Doors on both sides. That is, doors on both sides is so nice so, to make it easy for each each person to be able to get in and out without having to crawl over the other person. You got old moose here hanging out. That's the only moose I've seen in Yellowstone this week. <laughs> so far, so good. Uh, yeah, so we got storage up here in the cubby. This is actually known as the attic. These are the pass-throughs on the inside. The cool thing about this feature too, is these are like your marine openings. Okay, oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, and that's really nice, especially if it's like bad weather and stuff and you want to fix something to eat. You don't want to have to get out and go out, you know, to the to the galley. You can just kind of reach in and, and grab some snacks. These are all storage for drawers. Oh, okay. So you got some drawers, drawers there and stuff here. as well. Um, some of the features that you don't see is actually behind the couch here. Okay. Is the few boxes, fuse boxes right here. Okay, so everything's accessible. It's okay. accessible. And then when you when you lay out the, the mattress, your feet kind of tuck underneath all of that. Absolutely. Uh, there is storage. It has four G rings for uh, transport. Um, okay. Right here, so we strap. Okay, so you can strap stuff down. Oh, yeah, that's we, really nice. That's a nice touch. We netting in here so to tighten it up to make sure things don't come this way. It does have. Um, some storage here. Okay. So we use that. We also use these holders. We have key rings up here. You can set your phone in here. Yeah. Um, it has chargers up here. Oh, that's nice too. Okay, DC chargers. DC nice. DC chargers. Yeah, so you can set your phone and charge if you like to up here. Yep. Um, oh, that's really nice. I like the inside of that. Really well. And then as we come around to the galley side, okay, so I got your tank on this side. I'm assuming that's a little 10 pounder tank. And then you got the off road tires. Oh, those, and those are big too, sturdy. Mickey Thompson's. Yeah, okay. 
And these, uh, so this thing's really ruggedized as well. Absolutely, it has torsion axle underneath. It's got a 12 inch. It has a, a little bit higher pitch. Now the bean beans, a little they have different models. The bean bean is made for just a lot of dispersed camping. Right, kind of rugged outback stuff. A little stuff. bit of rugged outback stuff. Uh, these fenders, you can stand on them. If you can put, um, you can get to the top of it. If you need to do any cleaning, if you need to, uh, if you put a setup up top where you can put a tent. Right. Okay. Toppers. And then you get a full size spare, which is also really, full really nice. Spare. I know we didn't get a full size spare with ours. Um, that's been real enjoyable. It's got stabilizers down there. Yeah. Uh, we've got the shore power. You hook in here. Everything will run off of it. Right. And then you got your freshwater tank fill freshwater infill tank right fill. there. Has an 18 gallon freshwater tank fill. Oh wow, that's a big tank. Mine's only eight. Yeah, it's 18 gallon. Uh, this is drain for the sink, gray water, which we have going in the bucket over there. Yep. Okay. Uh, then to drain the 18 gallon of fresh water is right here. Right. Okay. So when you're done camping, it's, it's for all fresh water. It's then you got the hitch there. on the back, so you could throw a carrier or something back there as well. Or something back there also. Okay. Um, now with this uh, galley setup, uh, this particular setup has the uh, gas grill here. And stove so this goes in it locks in it locks out yeah um, we have storage under here yeah with easy access to your plumbing and yep. stuff like that Absolutely. it's got the sink here that will fold down for storage yeah okay so I'll stay in the steel it's it's under it's under cabinet yeah, that's really nice. I really like because there's some of the teardrops that use, you know, like uh, vinyl, you know, flooring kind of stuff. Right. And it's, you know, stainless steel is just so much nicer. It's a really nice touch. You can see other, the other we have here. Yeah. And then you've got the LED light strip. You got the LED light strip. We can, we can change, change all the colors. Oh, and it's all touch, just kind of just touch really sensors. Touch. We can turn it to that nice little red at night. Keeps the bugs down. Yep. Uh, if we want to go to the second favorite one, we can go back to that blue. You have everything in between also. You also got right. the outlets here. Those only work with your short power. power. Right. Uh, this one is GFC. Uh, we've got this built-in paper towel uh, holder. Yep. Which is awesome. It comes in really well. We've got two for one. Up there it adds a lot more light. Particularly we like it with just the LED. Um, and then you got, we really need to see something. Then you got your refrigerator that slides so right is, out. Uh, the Norcold 30 um, that we use it comes out. Um, and when we were talking earlier, you told me you were able to get four days out of out on battery on that. Yeah, we. we that we, is awesome. That's using, um, you know, the fan, the lights, and everything. Of course, it depends on what your use is and how hot it is outside right. and everything that you're really running. Uh, but we've been able to do that. Um, has a train inside it. It's running off. The other thing that we upgraded that you're not seeing right now is the lithium battery up front. Right. Uh, it's a Lions Energy 1300 UT 1300, and uh, it's been it's been awesome. Yeah. Uh, it's got the stabilizers. And then you said we're saying the construction on this is fiberglass construction, so one piece fiberglass. One piece fiberglass. Is, uh, yeah, construction. It has no seams at all. Right. Um, and that's really great for, for not having to worry about leaks or any of that other stuff. Absolutely. No, it's, it's been a tremendous product so far. We, we absolutely love it. Uh, we have the max fan up top that we've mentioned from the inside um, with the automated, you know, we can... And then how much does it weigh? It's, it's got 1850 is the dry weight. 1,850 okay. pounds is dry weight of the mean. Um, so and the different models have different different weight you're gonna have kind different of stuff. weights and different features and then you can always, uh, whatever you know your what you're wanting in the in the bean you can get so if you if you don't need this particularly galley is I think right. a couple steps up from what the, the standard would be uh, honestly, and then they build to order these right absolutely yeah if you go to um, beantrailer.com you can absolutely go through there and go through the build process right online and uh, Richard has been an outstanding uh, connection with the company he's he's been he, he responds back to you very quickly yep. very knowledgeable about the product and very forthcoming and he, he's happy to answer any questions you can. It's been a tremendous product um, that we've, we've enjoyed the heck out of it. And then coming around to the front, you've got a nice uh, storage rack I, I noticed. Yeah, I'm just going to show you real quick. Well, we, got the, we do have the one window on this side. Yep. Um, and these uh, are Just kind of little privacy yeah. block windows, privacy right? Privacy block window. My wife does much better at these than I do. Yep. I pressed 10. <laughs> there we go. Um, 
So and then you got a, a, a good size rack to store stuff, and it's a looks like it's a really beefy trailer frame as well. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, it's all mounted on there like this. We have the removable um, removable hitch. That is all. That's such a great security feature. Yeah, it's been that's been awesome. Like I said, we can mount anything. We can add extra coolers, some more firewood on the front, whatever right. we do. And then you got the the vertical hitch coming up right there. Yeah, we, we, yeah, we, the vertical hitch is a six inch hitch. We've added this, um, these two pieces, and of course the bike rack. To right, it. to get your bike rack and, and yeah, get it. Yeah, which uh, towed brilliantly uh, right. to get here. It also, what it, I don't know if it's not, it might be my favorite feature is this level right here. Yep. Um, just this little, just this little level is just outstanding uh, to get this thing. It, it sets up in a breeze. And yeah, okay. It's got awesome. it's got all the, all the other things that you normally do with a hitch. And you got like trailer brakes and stuff on here as well? Yes, it also comes with electric trailer brakes. Nice. So all we had to do is put a controller in the in the Jeep and uh, it was like a dream. And then you got the diamond plate uh, on the front so yep. when if stuff gets kicked up it's not going to puncture the, the skin or anything. That's that's a really nice touch as well. Yep. So uh, we've, we've been extremely happy with it. Well, awesome. This has been a great uh, great overview of the trailer. I, I really love this uh, love this design, some great features. And this is, uh, for you guys at home, this is the Mean Bean version. Um, and they do have other, uh, other models and stuff, so go check them out. Uh, tell them Chip sent you. And, uh, you know, and uh, you know, check out their trailers. Uh, thanks and everything. Thanks for uh, thanks for giving us a, an overview of the trailer, and uh, appreciate uh, appreciate you taking the time to show us. Thank you for coming by.